Okay, I want to show you about a feature um, in my language labs called We Speak that I'm actually going to um, have you guys, I'm going to send you the link so that you can go ahead and set yourselves up. I'm not going to assign this for a grade. This is more for practice if you're interested in it. I might assign some activities um, related to it at the end of the semester to count as extra credit, but for right now, this is a non-graded activity. This is just something for those of you who are really interested in Spanish and really want to learn to speak it. Um, when you go out here to the We Speak address, which you can see up in the top right here, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to link that and send it to you. Um, if you don't have an account, hit no account yet, and then you can do one of two things. You can either join with your uh, social media network, or you can set up an account using your email address and have a password. I went ahead and joined with my Facebook account, so I'm going to go back and go in with mine. I'm going to log in with Facebook, and it just takes a minute, and it logs me into We Speak. I am going to make myself busy so I can keep talking to you. Um, once it's done... Um, once you, when you go in and you're setting up, it's going to ask you a bunch of questions about yourself, the school that you go to, it's going to ask you about uh, your interest, and from that it's going to, it's going to pull up a bunch of people with whom you could speak all over the world. Um, so you can go in to, All right, so we also, once we get in there, we want to test our so, uh, test our setup to make sure that your camera and everything is working. If it doesn't pop up, or most of the time it pops up in the front with me, if it doesn't pop up in the front, you can go over here where it's got the little settings and go down to your uh, test your setup. And it's going to run through and test to make sure your browser is okay. It's going to test to make your hardware is okay. When this pops up, you want to hit share selected devices and close it and you want to make sure you can see yourself so that when you do do a web uh, when you're chatting with someone they can see this so I'm done I can go out into my community okay so these are the community I can make filters I put Spanish here and then I would put I think I put English here. Okay, and then it's just gonna pull up a bunch of people who are at the same level as me. Um, you probably had to put in, you know, when you're setting this up, it's also gonna tell you what language you're learning, um, as well as um, your native language, and you'll put in your level of what you're learning. And so out here, it's gonna say these people are available. Um, or if they're busy, and, and you can see, like, this person is, it tells you where these people are, and it tells you what language they speak, so you can decide whether you want to talk to them. And if you wanted to say hello to somebody, you just click on them, and you can start typing to them. Um, I will show you. So maybe I want to talk. And then I would say, hey, how's it going? Oh, wait. This person doesn't support um, audio video, so I would only be able to talk to him. Hey, how's it going? Um, and then I would just hit enter, and it would go straight to him. Or I could say it in Spanish. Hola. Como estas? and hit enter and it would go to him. Um, if I go back, let's see if we can find somebody who, let's see. This person doesn't either, either I'm trying to find someone who has video for you guys to see it. This person has video, so I could actually click on the video and then we could start conversing and she would pop up here and I would pop up in a screen over here and she would see me and I would see her and we could have a conversation. Um, so you can either chat with people or you can actually talk real time to them. So um, she speaks Spanish really well and a little bit of English. English is her target language. So someone like this is a good person to get connected with because 
she, you can, you can help each other out by sometimes speaking a little bit of Spanish and sometimes speaking a little bit of English. Um, so hopefully this helps you guys and you might want to just get set up if you leave it open and right now I'm saying busy but if I put available people will start messaging me you can see up here I've got notifications these are people who have written me um, here's someone who wants to be a friend so I'll just go ahead and accept them um, and so from there I guess then I have people over here who are who I've talked to and so I'll be able to see my online friends and immediately go to them um, and I think down here you can get help with finding a word I'm not sure what the notebook does that's if I want to make notes like if we're chatting and I want to write some things that I've learned so that I keep it um, I guess there's some features you can tell people to say it again or say it slower or ask them to write it um, so there's a bunch of tools that you can use when you're conversing with people, but I just found it to be very interesting. Um, and so, oh, someone just wrote, wrote hello. So anyway, I just found it to be very interesting and I think it's something that you should, uh, look into, look into using.